Hi everybody, my name is Mac. And I have an idea. I've heard that somebody was coming over for a playdate. Do you remember who's our playmate today? Me neither. Well, let's go inside my foster house and find out. Here we are guys. Now we're inside the magical foster house filled with imaginary friends. Now before we find out whose playdate was today, we've got Blue to find. Let me know when you see him. Hug attack. Oh god. You finally got me this time. Great hug attack by the way. Guess what? Somebody was coming over for our playdate, but I don't know who it could be. Do you know whose playdate is going to be Blue? Maybe we better find out whose playdate was going to be. I'll be right back. Let's use a wheel of playdates to see whose playdate is going to be today. Oh, that's a great idea, Blue. It sure is a big wheel. Let's figure out whose playdate is today by spinning the wheel. Will you help us? Awesome! Everybody, blow with us. We're, We're gonna, gonna have, have a playdate. Play Just, Just for, for all of us. us. We're gonna, We're have, gonna a have a playdate. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Oh. Look, Mac, it landed on the appliances. Look at that. The appliances came over to our house to play. Wow, those were some real appliances that talks to us. My name is Mac, and this is my best friend, Blue. Welcome to our foster house. Thank you, Mac and Blue. But why not we introduce ourselves? I'm Toaster. I'm Lampy. I'm Blanky. I'm Radio. And I'm Kirby. It's awesome to meet all of you guys. Come on inside. Our playdate starts now. Come on, guys. We've got plans to do. So, guys, what should we play first? You can play whatever you guys want. You guys can play some kids games. Like red light, green light, tag, peekaboo, have a race. What about playing hide and seek? That's a good game for some kids to play. That was the most awesome idea ever, Lampy. That game was something that me and my imaginary friends have never played before. How do you play that game though? It's real simple. One person needs to cover their eyes and count to 10. After they have counted one person must try to find the people that are hiding behind something. That's how you guys play hide and seek. Oh, oh I got it. How about we'll count to ten and you guys can go hide. Alright. Start counting, and then try to find us. One, one two, 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 three. three. Eight, eight, nine, nine, ten. ten. Okay, guys, ready or not, here we come. Let's go find the appliances that are hiding around the house. I'm gonna find you. Do you guys see Lampy or Radio anywhere? There you are, Lampy. You're behind the kitchen table. Oh man, I was so close. Okay, Blue. Let's find Radio anywhere. Okay, but don't throw your butts at me, Lampy. Let's go find him. He, 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 Blue or Lampy will never find me in here. Huh? Why is the blender talking to us? Hmm. That's weird. It sounded like Radio's voice. Hey, Radio. If it was you who was in that blender, come on out. Okay, guys. You found me fair and square. Let's just find everybody else in the foster house. Hey! Do you guys see Kirby in the gaming room somewhere? <sighs> what the heck? Was that you, Kirby? You were under the bed making noises, and it kind of scared me a little. I'm sorry, Mac. I didn't mean to startle you. But at least you found me. Let's go find the others, okay? I'll just use my binoculars this time. That way I'll find people a little easier. Nuthatch. Waxwing. 
Chickity. Aha. I can still see you, Toaster. You are behind the couch. <coughs> he, he, he. I guess Max Kitten Fluffkins gave me away. I will not make that mistake again. I'll tell you what, Kirby. We should split up to find Blanky. How about I'll start looking in the bathtub, and you go look in the toilet? Good thinking, Mac. Let's look for him. That's odd. Blanky is not in the toilet. Hello. Blanky? Are you in here? Do you guys see Blanky hiding anywhere? <coughs> huh. What was that sound coming from? It sounds like Blanky's coughing in the cupboard on top of the other towels. Blanky? Was that you in there? Why, yes, guys. It was me. I was coughing in the cupboard because it was kind of dark and dusty in there. That was an okay hiding spot, Blanky. But we're glad you were okay. At least our hide and seek game is all done. Let's go and have something else for our playdate. Come on, guys. Let's head down to the main hall. I'm going to put this clock up here. So that anybody will know what time it is. That was a really fun playdate, wasn't it appliances? Yeah, Blue, that was super fun. We might wonder if we should stay here in the magical foster house if we can think of new ideas for our next playdate. Was that okay with you, Mac? Yeah, Toaster, that's a great idea. But I wonder what shall we play next? That's the time again. Hey, Mac. What was the time? Well, we'd better check on the clock to see what time it is. Let's go to the clock. <laughs> Here we are at the clock, guys. That sounds great, Mac. Now look at the clock. What time is the clock showing? That's right. The clock was showing 3 a.m. That means it is almost snack time. Ooh, goody. Snack time is always my favorite time. Especially for lunchtime and supper time. That's great to hear. And I really love your attitude, Kirby. Okay. Let's go to the main hall to have a snack. I have a really fun playdate with you friends. You can come over to our magical foster house anytime. Yeah, thank you friends. Now we are going to sing a song for all of you. Get ready guys. Yeah, see you later, friends.